Let's simplify the fraction 12 16th. So what we want to do is we want to figure out another fraction that's equal to 12 over 16, but is in lowest terms. So to do that, we need to find the greatest common multiple. Let's start by listing the factors of 12 and 16. So these are the factors here for 12 and then for 16. And I see the greatest common factor, the one in common that's the largest is four. So if we divide 12 by four and 16 by four, we'll have reduced this fraction. Let's move these over here. So you can think about it like this. If we have four times three, that equals 12. And four times four, that equals 16. And now since the four here, we have it on the top and the bottom, we'll cross that out and we're left with three fourths. So when we simplify 12 over 16, we get three over four. And these fractions are equivalent. They have the same value. 12 divided by 16, three divided by four, they both equal 0 0.75. It's just that we've reduced 12 sixteenths down to three fourths. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.